this video I'm going to show you how to use a cylinder target feature in a Vuforia engine so cylinder target is same as the uh, multi target so in this cylinder target uh, this feature can identify the uh, image that wrap around the cylinder so uh, we can use this uh, cylinder target to scan some uh, wine bottles like that so let's go to our uh, project so we need to create a new scene so then I uh, imported AR camera so you need to import it import uh, view cylinder target inside the Vuforia engine so I click and go to Vuforia engine then select uh, cylinder target so this is our uh, cylinder target so this is the uh, default cylinder target so then click this uh, cylinder target you can see the cylinder target behavior so database is uh, Euphoria mass image so this is uh, default cylinder target so we need to create our own cylinder target so go to uh, developer.euphoria.com then go to target manager so we need to create a new uh, database so click this generate database select uh, type to uh, device then I can give a name for database so so this is my database now I need to add a target so then click this uh, cylinder so you need to uh, fill this uh, form like this uh, so we need to give dimensions of our cylinder so I will give one for everything uh, bottom diameter top diameter uh, side length so I will give a name testing uh, then I click OK now go inside this uh, cylinder target so you can see our cylinder like this so we need to upload uh, image for this uh, this side so we need to upload uh, 8 or 24 bit png or jpg image also we need to uh, maintain our uh, aspect ratio of this also uh, you can uh, you can get aspect ratio using chat GPT also it very easy uh, you need to give uh, diame diameters of the uh, circle and uh, height of the uh, cylinder so you can easily get the uh, aspect ratio of your height and perimeter so then I already created a uh, image like this this is height and this is the perimeter of the uh, circle so I use photo here this is uh, online tool free online tool then I will export this as a PNG So now it's okay. Go to uh, Vuforia developer site, then uh, click this upload site. Then I can select my uh, image, then open. Now you can download this uh, target database. So click this download database, then select Unity Editor, then download. go to unity then you need to import this uh, cylinder target now 
now it's okay so then you can uh, select the cylinder target then go to uh, inspector panel then you can select the uh, database now I will select uh, testing cylinder so this is our custom cylinder but in this case I will use uh, this uh, default cylinder because uh, we've already, uh, already give uh, printing a uh, PDFs so therefore I can uh, print and create the cylinder easily so therefore I will use it now then I need to add uh, augmented reality object so in this case I uh, imported uh, this small 3d rocket I will place it like this you can adjust the position using this handle now it's okay for me so then you need to drag and drop inside this uh, cylinder target because the all always the augmented reality object must be uh, child object of the uh, cylinder target so then you can save it now our uh, cylinder target project is ready to build then go to files then click this build settings then go to player settings you need to change some values in uh, other settings inside the other settings uh, inside the configurations uh, you need to change scripting backend to IL2 CPP then uh, tick mark to ARM64 and I untick to uh, ARM V7 so you can also select a uh, minimum API level for uh, Android 8.0 so and target level API you can uh, select uh, latest one so then you can close this uh, project settings then you can build it to a app like this